までの記憶の全部を消してしまう時まで眠れない Yo, so welcome back to some more All Star, guys. So, today we're gonna be looking at Gilgamesh. I finally got the six star version of him, of course, level 80. We're gonna be going into infinite mode and、uh, checking out how OP this guy is. You guys know me, I usually go in there, we、uh, check out how good these characters are, and I Buff him with Merlin and Erwin, and、uh, I give you guys my opinion on the character. So, I mean, hopefully. Gilgamesh is good. I heard a lot of good things about him. I'm kind of late with this kind of review. I'm super sorry about it. I had some stuff I had to handle IRL, so it is what it is. But better late than never, right? Alright, guys, so I'm in infinite mode, and、uh, yeah, the character does cost 1 million to place down, so I have to use Bulma, the new 5 star money unit, to get my money up because、uh, she's the only unit that could basically allow you to place down something like Gilgamesh that has this much. Requirements one million, my guy. One million, like who would have ever thought that we would have to get one million to place on a unit? Not me, I know it wasn't you either. I could kind of see, like, you know, a new unit being added in the game, something like Zeno from Dragon Ball costing one million, doing some next crazy kind of thing. Anyway, now we continue to farm on All Star. Hopefully, I get to one million soon. All right, guys, so I'm at wave 34, and yeah, I'm still at. This much amount of money, like I still don't have enough to place down a Gilgamesh. I would have probably had enough if I didn't place down my two maxed out Gokus, but I had to so I could actually survive because I'm on extreme mode and I bought, you know, Gilgamesh on extreme mode because this dude is pretty much one of the most broken care. Oh, and I can place him down. Okay, here we go. Placing down Gilgamesh, as you can see, she does 8,000 damage every 0.1 second. So, He has 60 range as well, and I'm just here, like, just looking at it, like, wow, this dude really out here doing that much damage in, in 0.1 second. Okay, let me try to calculate how much damage he does in one second. So, give me one moment, guys. Guys, Gilgamesh does 80,000 damage a second, and that's without buffs. I don't know how, how this guy does it. I don't know how, like, bro, this dude is OP, okay? He's literally the most busted character in the game. And I mean, this is basically a single target character done right. That's all I'm gonna say. It's, it, that's what it is. It's, it's basically that's what it is. Single target character made right. And then he also has different switch、uh, attack pattern stuff. So let me just switch his attack pattern. Okay, so this attack pattern is actually an AoE circle. And this time he attacks every four seconds. Looks like his range doesn't change. And he does 403,000 damage. Wow. That is insane. And look at that attack right there. So he basically summons his like gates or whatever with the sword stuff. I never watched Fate, so I don't know anything about this character. But yeah, the attack is cool, I guess. Let me switch his attack pattern one more time. Let's check out what this is. Okay, so we got another AoE circle. Basically, this one removes 10 range and basically doubles his SPA and the damage. So if you want it to, like, you know, hit more. You know, heavier than you basically switch to this version. Let me switch up the pattern again. Okay, we got wow, we got a AoE cone. That's actually pretty good. Attacks every 30 seconds with three. Bro, what is that? What is that number? Is that 3,835,000 every 30 seconds with 111 range? Oh, am I not gonna have time to buff my unit? Oh no, are you gonna be serious? Oh no, dude. Oh wow. Oh wow. Oh, I gotta do this again because I need to buff Gilgamesh. I need to know how much that. What is that attack, my guy? What the? Okay, give me a moment, guys. There's no way. I, I need to see this. All right, guys. So I finally got 1 million once again. All right, let me place him down and switch him to the one attack pattern where he was AoE Cone. Let me find it. I can't find it. I think it's after this one. Not after this one. I think this is the hit. Oh, this is it. Yeah. I don't know why I still. Oh, there you go. For a second there, like I still showed that it was AoE Circle. Okay, so this right here does 300. <laughs> never mind, not 300. 3,835,000. It's just insane to me how much damage he does. Now, I really want to see this attack that he's about to do. Because last time we saw it, but it literally ended right away. There it is. Oh my god. It's just a giant blast that just shreds everything up. Okay, that's cool. I wonder what other modes he has, though. Oh, and then he has his.、Uh, okay, well, basically, this is the basic base form, I guess, or attack pattern, whatever. Basically, he attacks fast. Okay, so 
this is Gilgamesh. Now, let's go ahead and buff him real quick. I want to see how good he is with buffs. So, let me play some stuff down real quick. All right, so if I buff this right here, let's check out how much damage he goes up to while he's at this state. 24,000 every 0.1 second. That is just it. Look at my damage, guys. My damage is going up like insane. I wonder how much damage you could get if you did like a damage farm with this. It would be pretty insane. Guys, this dude does 204,000 every one second. 204,000 every one second. What the heck, my guy? Okay, all right. Let's check out his other attack patterns, though, when he is buffed. So let me go ahead and change that. And buff and buff. Okay, okay. Let's see how much... Okay, now he's at 1 million damage. All right, with this one. Switch the attack pattern again. Okay, this time it didn't change his damage. The heck? That's weird. Why is attack pattern not changing? So I don't think this guy's attack pattern can change when he's buffed. So I'm going to wait for the buff to go away and then I could change it probably. Oh yeah, you have to wait for the buff to go away so that you could actually change his attack pattern. Okay, let's see. Uh, Okay, so at this attack pattern, I guess a third one. Now he deals 2,600,000 damage every 8 seconds. I mean, literally every single like... um. Basically, every single, like, pattern this guy's on, he's dealing millions of damage. Except for the fast one. But that one, like, he does, like, what? 240k every second. Like, it's just insane. Attack, Like I said, guys, single target character done right. Now, let me change his attack pattern one more time. So, this is where he does 3.8 million every 30 seconds. What happens if I buff this guy? How much damage will he do? Oh, my God. 11 million guys this guy does 11 million damage every 30 seconds hold on let me buff him with uh merlin real quick we need to check merlin as well all right let me put a merlin on him right now 149 range with 11 million damage dude you could farm with this like crazy oh look at my look at my damage it went up so much wow that is insane that is insane Okay, I'm gonna chill in this game for a little bit until it actually ends. I wanna see how like how much damage I could get while we're at wave 35. Cause there's gonna be like a lot of enemies soon, right? So I mean I kind of messed up the placement for this character. I should not really place him here, but I guess it is what it is. I can still attack with him, that's all that matters. So it's not a big deal, I guess. But still, like if I would have placed him at a better location, it would have been better. You know, more damage, more results, but it's good like this as well, honestly. Now I'm at 196 million damage. Can I get to a million damage in like a few rounds? I meant to say a billion. Can I get to a billion damage? I'm already at 289 million, guys, and it's literally been like two rounds. Okay, this will be the fourth time he's attacking. I'm at 416 million damage. The animation's pretty cool as well, I guess. It's nothing too serious, but... I mean, the whole attack is all about the beam, right? So, yeah. But you guys get the drift. I mean, literally, what? Three rounds passed and I went up like 300 million more damage. So, literally, this is like the ultimate gem grinder. Ultimate what? Basically, it's the ultimate unit on the game, okay? That's all I'm going to say. It's, it's the ultimate unit. Anyway, if you guys enjoyed this video, be sure to like and subscribe if you haven't. Because I'm going to end it right there. Literally, there's not that much else to show you guys. He's the best unit, and that's it. So, uh, if you enjoyed this video, be sure to like and subscribe if you haven't. Please. And uh, see you guys in the next one. Bye.